All right, guys, once again, happy birthday, Naruto. <laughs> Not in every video. <laughs> Today's a good day. We have ourselves Demon Slayer, Mushoku Tensei, and Tricorded Window. As you can tell by the title of this video, I'm gonna be watching The Night Beyond the Tricorded Window episode two. Um, this is the Shonen I BL kind of energy vibes, supernatural as well though. Mystery, stuff like that. We got ghosts. But y'all already know. Last week I'm like, take this away from me. Like, this is a dangerous zone. This kind of show always makes me either laugh so much or like squeal or just fangirl, like whatever it is. But it is a ton, ton of fun. So in last week's episode, we met the two. We met the two. Uh, and they kind of found the corpse, actually. They were investigating a situation. Well, first, they kind of, like, ended up working together. And now they're working together. And they, you know, discovered the body of the, the missing parts of the women that were missing. <laughs> they discovered the body that was created by the missing parts of multiple other women. Um, and apparently there's this name. I forgot the name, but there's a name that was mentioned and... Apparently she's the one kind of like cursing people and I think it's that young woman that we saw at the end and, and talking with the old lady but um Or maybe it's not one of them at all. Maybe it's the voice that was just cursing somebody next or it's the old lady I don't know, but this is this is fun. This is fun. So you know what guys without further ado Let's get into episode two This episode is called Binding. What was with that shot? I was about to say, I'm like, they're trying to show us that he's like looking at her. I'm like, okay. <laughs> Yo, she does not play. I was like, they were trying to show that he was looking, looking. Mm -hmm. You got other things to look at now, though, sir. <laughs> See, this, I hate. I'm. He's hella fine, though. Why'd you close? Okay. Oh, he's smiling. <gasps> Sorry, but he's hella fine, though. That man. He's, he's the whole problem so far. <laughs> oh. do that what sir what oh my god he can't see it <gasps> Oh, he can see like you. He's out. He took over his body! <laughs> he stopped! He kicked him out and took over his body! Get out! Oh no! Oh, he got punched then. <laughs> Dang! Whoa! How'd I say? Damn! Oh, we got some Sherlock things going on. Some Moriarty the Patriot. Heard it? Yeah. Mm. Mm. 
Facts. <laughs> Oh my goodness. <laughs> Low key. <laughs> He's in front of other girls too, young girls. He has to, you know. Yeah, because you're with him! Like, come on, you wouldn't be that scared for that long. Does he see something? Oh, he found it, I guess. And he went there alone this time. I like how instinctually he just touched him so he could see, like it became so habit now, like just touch him so he could see what I'm seeing. <laughs> You're sus. <gasps> it's her. Okay. Oh my god! She was just controlling him. Hold on, wait, what did she make him say? Oh my god, that's so freaking creepy! That is so creepy! Oh my god, oh my god, okay, wait, what did, what did, In order to make sure nothing like it happens again, it would be wise to search inside yourself for the original cause. That's interesting that Erica's making him say that because, like, what is she saying? Like, who does she curse and why? Is it because they have something bad about them, maybe? Maybe she does it to, like, rude bitches. Bro! Hex nah! That's so creepy! <laughs> Dude walks away. I don't need to hear this bullshit. <laughs> we agree to be bound to the following terms. <laughs> With work. <laughs> Supply, Mikado Kosuke. Your name's Kosuke! <laughs> With work. It's these damn Kosuke's. The lack of hesitation. Ooh, what is he writing? Mikado Kosuke. What? Damn! Okay, what are y'all up to? I do see how she might be captivating, but we can't have that. <laughs> I can't. So I get the feeling what he's doing right now is trying to make sure that she can't be overcome by her anymore. And maybe he can only be overcome by him now. I can't breathe. Oh, whoa, sir. Sir, damn. I mean, in real life, stuff like that is not cool. That's like obsessive and you're like t controlling, like, no. But. <laughs> sir. What are you doing here? I had a feeling it wasn't going to be the last we see of him. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> Bro, what the heck? This show's like 
actually so cool. Also, you know, the same things are always like the more dominant, taller kind of guys. I have a thing with potential same things like this. When they could be shorter, but they're like really cool and confident. <laughs> I have a thing for those ones. Oh, no. Oh, wow. Oh my god, they're like connected. What did you say? What did what did he say? No, I need to know what he said. him I like him I don't know what it is I'm telling you I like the I like that kind of thing too <laughs> oh he's pretty good at what he does oh my <gasps> oh he's like trapped him in a way to not be able to sync with anybody else damn <laughs> I did not expect him to work with somebody else, nor did I expect this new character to come in this way. Oh, I see. Oh my god, he's not even allowed- he was gonna say like- He was gonna actually compliment him and say like, maybe I like you, just I like you, and- He couldn't even say that. Oh, you're tied up right now, my dear. Oh my god! He's literally, like, tied him. Like, he's marked him. Yo, this one just pulled up. Like, excuse you. Did it pass through him or it entered him? Dude, you can't be that creepy. Stop. Bro, what is that? What is that? Do you see that shot? Nah, no, I'm leaving. I'm I'm done. What is that? Do you see this? <laughs> what the frick? <laughs> Bro. Bro. He's a little scary. Oh, wait. Is he making a barrier right now? I can isolate us too. Bro, stop with this. Do you see those shots? Wait, hold on. Uh, okay, we're gonna talk about this after. Uh, hmm. Oh, there's something wrong with you. Wait, there's something wrong with him. We saw in last week's episode he was like drinking. 
drinking something. What was it? A heart? Like, no, this this something wrong with you. What if you're like, wait? What if he's like Huda Erika? Like he's like some type of like I don't know. I don't really know. I like this. I like this other blonde dude. I kind of like that he's in this, bro. Look at this picture. <laughs> Okay. Okay, sir. Bro. <laughs> I love you, sir. Hmm. There's, not, there's definitely this thing about triangles. Wait, who, I'm gonna go back. Who did it say died? Was it that woman? Hold on. Wait, was it that woman that actually died like she said she would? What's her purpose in doing this, though? What's her- like, why does she do what she does? Maybe she just hates the world. Defense lawyer Mia Kawayuriko dies. Yeah. Why does she do this? Oh, when I said take this away from me, I meant it, y'all. <laughs> this show has me off the rails. Okay, we we heading into a territory. <laughs> um So, homeboy, he's scaring me. He is scaring me. Like, it actually seems like, you know, in some ways we could have taken this as a like, oh, he's like a possessive guy, da da da. The possessive same, but it feels like more than that. This actually feels scary. It kind of feels scary. Like there's something wrong that we need to address when it comes to him. Like he's literally tying him up. He doesn't know. He's manipulating how he be how he behaves now on a regular. He's branded him without telling him. It's like this is a bit. It's not forward enough. And it's like scary. The scene where he had him on his knees and and grabbed him, it's almost like he kinda hurt him a little bit. Like he like when he pulled out the ghost or whatever, he didn't do it in a way that would prevent pain. It's like he was and he said it himself, he's like, I fell into a rage. Like he's actually typically what we would consider a scary person that's just not. It's that's not good. I'm really liking the other blondie. <laughs> like I just like him as a guy, as a character. Um, he seems actually like a nice dude. Yeah, he's low-key scamming people out here, but you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. <laughs> but he's not like fully, like he does help where he actually can help, it seems. And he was more gentle. <laughs> like between the two, it almost seems like he would, you know, create a healthier relationship. Whereas our dude, as we know him over here, is has a little bit less of a healthy relationship thing going on. So I didn't, I didn't expect to start fearing him like this he's, he's a little creepy y'all with that being said i wonder how they're gonna try to take this show and take this relationship um to me i don't yet see if this is a show that's actually gonna end with any romance or anything like that i just feel like it's a shown in eye like a bl that's just on the tease level like they're just constantly feeding us that without actually delivering i feel like this show might be like that i don't really s i can't visualize an actual romance thriving or like happening I can see how it could be possible, but like at the same time with the story, I just don't see it actually going there. So yeah, it just it just makes me wonder what they want to do with this relationship. Why is it feeling almost wrong and bad? Is is our is Rihito gonna like notice this and he's gonna is he gonna address it? Are they gonna split or are they gonna fix him up and then become closer that way? Like as for Hirda Erika, it's like girl, why are you doing what you're doing? Maybe she's a girl that like hates the world and she's just doing stuff like this but she is a student and she's actually hurting people and she can control people and stuff like this i'm not gonna lie the the what this show has to offer is amazing for me because not only is it like horror mystery all that good stuff it is shown and i so it's definitely giving me those moments as you guys can see but um it also seems to have a lot of interesting detail in the story in in the world 
Um, I thought it was really cool how they're delivering, you know, the powers or the supernatural and stuff like that. I am really enjoying this. And I hope you guys are too, so leave comments. That is the end of this video. Thanks so much for watching. Leave how you feel, and I'll see y'all again in my next video. So thank you, and bye.